Do you know you are responsible for killing the earth? Good afternoon, judges. My name is Annabelle, and I am from Xinyi Branch. My topic for today is: I will stop the person who invented plastic straws. Imagine you saw a video that's about the plastic straw that stuck in the sea turtle's nostrils. How will you feel? I always feel guilty when I see it. So, I want to remove this invention from history. First, I will travel back to January 3, 1888, Washington D.C. I will walk down the street and find the cameo store that Mr. Marvin C. Stone worked at. When I find it, I will ask to talk to Mr. Marvin C. Stone and let him sit down to listen to me. I will prepare two large bowls of water. One with all kinds of ingredients that people maybe will use for making drinking straws, and one with plastic. I will wait for a long time to let those ingredients to break down. When it is finished, I will tell him that plastic won't break down in water that easily. Secondly, Mr. Marvin C. So may be wondering if there's another alternative material after I told him that plastic wasn't a good idea for the earth. He can use biodegradable material. Biodegradable material won't be bad for the earth. You can even eat it when you finish your drink. Thirdly, if Mr. Marvin C. Stone agrees with this idea, I will tell him how plastic destroy the earth and pollute the earth full of garbage in the future, and I will show him some photos of garbage mountains in the oceans. I think after I tell him how bad plastics are. He will realize the consequences of this invention. I hope everyone will use less plastic straw than usual, and I also hope that plastic straw factory can change to produce paper straws. That will let the earth have no more garbage in the oceans. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your patience. I appreciate your attention with my speech.